the drums and cymbals this evening, Mr. Paul Wells. Give it up. Yeah. yeah. At the double bass, Mr. Neil Minor. Playing the piano, Mr. Jeb Patton. And co-leading the quintet at the saxophones, Mr. Peter and Will Anderson. Give it up. Enjoy.
by the great Duke Ellington, who composed over a thousand songs, and we went through all of th the a thousand to choose that, that last particular song. This, yeah, we went through all of them, and that was the last one we found. So it took a long time. And uh, we love Duke Ellington's music. He traveled uh, he said he, he traveled 52 weeks a year with his big band, and if there were 53 weeks in the year, he would travel 53 weeks in the year. And he's the one who used to tell his audiences that we love you madly. 
That was called I Got It Bad and That Ain't Good. And uh, we opened up with a Julie Stein composition that was called Just In Time. Let's have a round of applause for our pianist, Jeb Patton, on the piano. Yeah. Jeb Patton. On the bass, Mr. Neil Miner. Yeah. <laughs> On the drums, we have a gentleman who is a TV star. You can see his face all over the Bernie Madoff documentary called Wizard of Lies. Is that true? And I can tell that no one's seen that before. <laughs> So I guess you're not so much of a star as you thought. Paul Wells on the drums. Paul Wells. On the tenor saxophone, on the tenor saxophone we have a gentleman who was my roommate for many years. Also for nine months he was my womb mate. My older brother by 10 minutes. Peter Anderson on the tennis saxophone. Mm. Womb. Yes. My name is Will Anderson. I am the younger brother, but I'm taller by one inch. So keep that in mind. Thank you. Thank you very much. Speaking of Duke Ellington, uh, this week in New York, we are um, happy to be celebrating at Jazz and Lincoln Center the Essentially Ellington Week, where they're yeah. playing a ton of uh, Duke Ellington music. I think we have some students in the competition yeah. of the Essentially yeah. Ellington Week. What high school you from? Washington, north of Seattle. All right, Washington State. Very cool. So our students are right up front here. And uh, they're actually in the splash zone. Oh, yeah. You're gonna get some spit. You're gonna get maybe some shards of reeds will be flying at you guys. So be careful. Uh, we'd like to move right along and play a composition by a musician who was deeply influenced by Duke Ellington. Um, he also led a big band like Duke Ellington did. And whenever he performed with his big band, he would wear a necktie with Duke Ellington's face on it. This is how much he loved Duke Ellington. But not everyone knows this about this musician. And um, he was a trumpet player by the name of Dizzy Gillespie. So we're gonna play Dizzy Gillespie's composition entitled Groovin' High. Thank you. 
for Jeff Patton on the piano. Uh, this is Jeff Patton. On the big bass, Mr. Neil Miner. Neil Miner. On the drums and cymbals, Mr. I guess Bernie Madoff's drummer. Paul Wells. Paul Wells. Peter Anderson on the tenor saxophone. Will Anderson on the alto saxophone. Thank you very much. That was a Jerome Kern composition called Nobody Else But Me. And uh, speaking of Jerome Kern, my brother and I are leading a show at Symphony Space this coming August that's going to run the entire month. We're doing uh, 32 consecutive shows and we're celebrating Jerome Kern along with Hoagie Carmichael, Irving Berlin, and uh, lastly Jimmy Van Heusen. So we've got some flyers up here if anyone's interested. We've got um, CDs available and uh, the, the CDs uh, we're giving away. We're not charging anything for the CDs. But it's a package deal, and the autographs are fifteen dollars. So that's that's how that works. Um, we're gonna play one more composition for you all. And I also uh, forgot to introduce the the tune prior to the last one. That was composed by the great Billy Strayhorn. That was called Chelsea Bridge. And uh, today is a very special day for us. It it marks the uh, two year anniversary of the death of. Uh, my saxophone mentor, um, along with my, my brothers as well, we both studied with a gentleman named Joe Temperley, who was a baritone saxophone player. How about a hand for Joe Temperley? So we'd like to dedicate this last one to Joe Temperley. Uh, but before I do that, I just want to see if there's, if there's anyone out there um, in the audience who has seen us perform before. Anyone? Okay, just... A few of you. I guess we're not as as famous as we thought. So how many of you is this your first time hearing our group? All right. Fantastic. We love new audience members. Is this any, anyone's last time hearing us? No. Okay, not sure. Well, we're going to close off with a Clifford Brown tune. We hope you enjoy Blues Walk.
Robin Eubanks coming up at 10.30. If you'd like to stick around for that show, there is an additional $20 charge. And we'll be around to collect that momentarily. Otherwise, we want to remind you that your ticket here at Smalls is also good down the block at our other club, Mesro. 
tonight we have the wonderful Ehud Sherry with this trio. It's not to be missed. Thank you for joining us.